Tesla has introduced a new version of the J1772 wall connector as a home charging solution for Tesla and non-Tesla electric vehicles. Priced at $550, the new home charging station is described as an ideal charging solution for houses, apartments, hospitality properties and workplaces. In addition, it's designed for both indoor and outdoor use. The new J1722 wall connector comes with a 24-foot, 7.3-meter, cable, multiple power settings and it's said to add up to 44 miles, 70 kilometers, of range per hour, depending on the vehicle it's hooked up to. Tesla says the new connector can also power share to maximize existing electrical capacity, automatically distributing power and allowing for the charging of multiple vehicles simultaneously. For developers, managers or owners of commercial real estate who are interested in purchasing more than 12 J1772 wall connectors, Tesla offers that possibility on the website's commercial charging section. Unlike most its competitors that use the CCS J1772 standard, Tesla uses its own proprietary connector for vehicles produced for the North American market. As a result, the company's charging network and products, such as home chargers, only work with its own electric vehicles. However, this J1772 wall connector in combination with the SEI J1772 charging adapter supplied with each Tesla can charge Tesla EVs as well. Mind you, chances are not many Tesla owners will purchase the J1772 wall connector, as the original wall connector equipped with the Tesla proprietary plug is cheaper at $400. In recent months, Tesla has shown willingness to open up its own charging network and products to electric vehicles from other automakers. After adding CCS connectors to supercharger stations in Europe, the US EV maker has been indicating that it will do the same in North America. In May, Elon Musk tweeted that Tesla would add CCS connectors as an option to superchargers in the United States, but didn't offer a timeline for that. Thanks for watching. Credits to InsideEVS.com and Spied Build LLC. Please like my video and subscribe EVpedia for more electronic vehicle news and updates.